Lever 349. Now, I've, I've made some observations. I have a feeling that people probably, as they grow older and mature and um, develop, that they probably grow older and mature and develop. And that the behaviours of younger years, not really the behaviours as they get older, because they, they get over sort of carnalities and sins and childishnesses and immaturities and wicked sort of behaviour. Gradually as people age, over time, they mature. And I think I've, I've observed this generally in my life experiences. So much so that I feel that now, coming to the end of an earthly life is probably just the first phase of a human's development. That this, this, this physical earthly structure is where we develop for a while and then we go on to the next phase which is a spiritual phase and a heavenly system. And that um, I don't think accepting the idea that you die uh, physically is justifying the idea that you're justifying death. Probably not. It's probably just the transitional phase. Uh, death is probably where we transition from this human life on earth to the spiritual life in heaven. But it's a maturing progress and when your lifespan is over, you move on with the next next aspect of your, your eternity, your, your, your life. So we're only here for a while, and then we move on. So, um, I suppose theoretically it's possible that you can choose to endure eternally in the physical world as your natural habitat, but the, 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 the heavenly thing is probably a more natural habitat for people as they develop and mature and they get to the point where more suitable to the, the heavenly environment with people of a more advanced way of life. Earth works for a while, but then you go on to the heavenly thing, where people are a bit more advanced and I suppose more mature and are developed a bit more, more complex.